Some 100,000 locals in Sri Aman, Sarawak are not only choking on haze but also experiencing water shortage due to the prolonged dry weather. Although the air pollutant index in the area has improved, the haze still remains at very unhealthy levels. Operations have been mobilized to address the simultaneous problems of the haze and water shortage. Hari ini kita telah uh, menerima 80,000 uh, face mask uh, uh, daripada uh, APM uh, dan uh, mask ini akan kita edarkan uh, kepada semua yang berada di uh, bagai ini khususnya agensi-agensi kerajaan, uh, penuntut-penuntut sekolah, uh, institusi-institusi uh, yang berada di seraman ini dan juga uh, mereka yang memerlukan bantuan uh. dan pada hari ini juga uh, kita akan mendapat uh, khidmat uh, water bombing uh, uh, daripada uh, APMM uh, uh, daripada Miri lah. Five centralized water collection centers have also been established in Sri Aman Town, Kampung Pakit and Lachau. Located close to the Sarawak-Kalimantan border, Sri Aman is the first area in Malaysia to enter the hazardous level since the transboundary haze caused by slash-and-burn agricultural practices started choking the country early this month.